do this. And I'm here with a haul uh, to Dollar Tree and Kohl's after work. So I'm going to show you Dollar Tree stuff first. I picked up these three super glossy lip shine enough to get their skin. Okay. So there's Hardy Peach. And then there is the candlelight. And then the other one. And what's the pot? In most other places, you're probably going to find Elf, whether it's like the regular line or the studio line. And you can tell if it's the studio line because it's more like. I guess like mm, nicely packaged, like it's usually black and like a whitish color. And this is just standard one dollar stuff. And I saw these revitalizing eye pads. This is supposed to improve the skin elasticity. And it says once per week after cleansing, after the pads, cleanse the eyes and remove. After 15 minutes. And if you want to get curious, because it's like the dark circles and stuff in it. Well, at least I know these ones are. I thought I would try one of each. Like, I know this one is going to improve elasticity, and this is to help reduce dark under eye shadows. And I do have dark circles, and that way I make up. And some days are worse than others. I guess it depends on my sleep. And same thing up there, it says, use one to reduce cleansing, apply the pads on your eyes and move up to 15 minutes. So, just wondering if there is something new. And usually, I well, usually get a kind of makeup wipe to take off my makeup, or if it's in the middle of it's hand in it, but I still like to always make my makeup anyway, but I saw these, and <laughs> it was just really neat. Like, it just says, right out there, moisturizing, cleansing, acne wipes. So I don't really know to trust it, since it's a dollar store. I mean, I don't mean that in a bad way, but like, some things in the dollar store are just like, okay, work really well, if you find something that works works really well or it's just kind of crappy. So this is the salicylic acid and salicylic acid is in most products that like they're guaranteed to like really help with your acne or a stronger or something along those lines of salicylic acid so I think the wipes will be fine. I'll let you know if anything good or happens. So if that happens but yeah. Like, I never really saw, like, acne wipes, and never really in the dollar store. And it comes with 30 of them, so I guess you can use it to take off your makeup, it doesn't really count. So I say moisturizing and cleansing, um, so I guess you could. I don't know. So yeah, that's all I got at the dollar store. <coughs> at Kohl's the other day, I got this shirt. It was down to like six dollars, but then my mom did still have a price adjustment, so it was like four dollars. So it's just a purple, like white purple hellcat shirt with like the dark purple, blackish lighting. That's it, Hello Kitty. I know I'm 20 years old and I still like Hello Kitty. I think. I mean, there's not really an age limit for Hello Kitty. Like, Hello Kitty has been around for so long that people that are way older than me still love Hello Kitty. I mean, maybe grown, like a grown, grown old ladies are like, like, still like Hello Kitty because it's 
feet, and it all started out with a lunchbox, and then it just turned into this, like, big thing where, like, everybody had to have Hello Kitty everything. So, speaking of Hello Kitty, I went to Kohl's tonight, and I saw this, I didn't really notice before. And it's darker purple Hello Kitty hoodie. And then it has, like, a pink little bow, and she's, like... She's cute as always. Like, how could you just can't be cute? <laughs> she cannot not be cute. That's what I mean. And that would have been 1080 on clearance. Normally around $36 for a drone for this place. I think that's a little crazy. But it was 70% off. And then my mom had like a 35% off thing, I'll go like the whole order, so all this stuff was about 10 bucks. Go back and play the original prices too. This, the shirt I just showed you, would have been $20 originally. So my whole purchase would have been just that thing. If I didn't get it on sale. Kind of crazy. Then these I just like fell in love with, and they were only like there at all in the print. And the brand name is Lily Rose. I don't know if that means anything. If, she's, if it's like a company or just like one person that has their own line. But these are medium. Normally like $24. And then they were down to $480. Probably would have been even cheaper though with my mom's clearance thing. So they're just like flowers and skulls. You can really even see the skulls. Yep, there's one. There we go. <laughs> but they're like all over, but it's easier to see the flowers. My mom wears a lot of the same kind of stuff I do. I mean, not style-wise, but just because they're both tiny enough that we can fit in each other's clothes. And she was going to wear these. And she's like, oh, I didn't realize they had skeleton heads and, like, they're skulls. I didn't say the word skulls, but, yeah, she didn't realize. <laughs> and then that made her change her mind to wanting to wear them. These I really, 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 really like, but they're not going to fit. I'm going to be disappointed because I didn't feel like trying them on there. But these are just a zero. I don't really know if they're supposed to be high waisted or not, but they're just shorts. And they're like a mix of blue. I love shorts like this. And they are about seven sixty. Normally thirty eight dollars. Uh, the only color and size and stuff of this pair of shorts, but I really hope they fit. Because in those shorts, I'm like size, like 1 3 or something like that, not usually a zero. But some brands make sizes differently, so I think they just fit, but I don't know. If not, I guess they're going back or they're going to somebody I know that is time me. So I hope they fit. And you're probably thinking, like, Emily, why are you getting shorts when it's like close to winter and it's like fall now. I wear leggings on it, that's why. I'm not gonna just like wear these like without anything else. I usually just layer them with leggings like these. And if it's warm in the place I'm being, it's not really gonna matter because I'm not gonna walk or anything. And sometimes we get somewhat nice weather in PA where I am. And then, I found this, would have been 20, it was down to 6, so then probably cheaper because it's 35% off the purchase, or whatever it was. So it's like a light bluish shirt that has pictures of the members from the Eagles. My 
mom and my sister always used to play the Beatles, and I just always heard them on the radio. The songs always got stuck in my head, and I pretty much just always liked them. And my, one of my favorite songs from them is probably Strawberry Fields Forever. But that's for sure. Their Cold Wine, which is the, uh, the Beatles, it's like a authentic brand on the tag. It has like a little app on it says Beatles. So yeah, that's all I got at Kohl's and that's all I got at Dollar Tree. And if you're wondering what lipstick I'm wearing, because I never wore this before, it is the NYX Black Label lip Lipstick in Amethyst. Which is actually my first stone. <laughs> and first. So yeah, one to six, sixty-two and a first. Where is it? I don't know if you guys really realize it now I've mentioned it in a video or two, but I've been into the gothic high style goth. Not necessarily just gothic, but high style goth style so it's kinda like People can make it as bright as they want, or as dark as they want, or do like a combination of whatever. And it's just like, that's what I pretty much have always worn anyway. I just never really realized what it was considered. But under a label, it would be like pastel goth. So, and even it can be more inspired to get like pastel-y, purple -y things. More studs, more spikes, more skulls, more... Everything that I've always liked, but it's into a style now. And it's probably been out for a couple of years. I just never opened my eyes to it until recently. But I really like that one. Like, even if I were able to dress a little more how I want to at work, I like these pants when I want to wear a, a more pastel goth stuff. Because they're really cute, really bright, and really cool. And then. You can like wear whatever you want to make it look badass too. So it's like cute and dark. So yeah, that's really all today. So I'll see you guys later.